Good morning, it's Cassandra Christopher from Village Church. Today I would like to read a devotion I prepared for you called Shine Your Light. And this comes from Matthew chapter 5 verses 14 through 16. Let me read that for you. You are the light of the world. A town built on a hill cannot be hidden. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bowl. Instead, they put it on its stand, and it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. Darkness is defined as the absence of light. The only way to dispel darkness is to shine light. From the beginning of time, light and darkness have existed together. In Genesis chapter 1, verses 2 and 3, it says this, Darkness was over the surface of the deep, and the Spirit of God was hovering over the waters. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. From that moment on, light and darkness existed together. Until we come into that relationship with Christ, we are in the darkness. Once we accept him as our Lord and Savior, we are not in that darkness any longer. We're filled with the Holy Spirit, and his light can then shine through us. 2 Corinthians 4, verses, verse 6 says, For God, who said, let light shine out of the darkness, made his light shine in our hearts. To keep our light shining bright, we need to keep connected to Christ. By abiding in him, he will use us in ways we may never have imagined. The lives we touch with our light may not always be obvious to us. Remain connected through prayer and God's word and let your light shine. Today, make a difference in the darkness of this world by shining bright for Jesus. Let me close us in prayer. Lord Jesus, we thank you for being the light within us so we can shine brightly for the world around us. Use us to make a difference. You are the hope we need and the true light that will never burn out or fade away. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for listening and have a beautiful day.